what's going on linky here and welcome back to another episode of the purge smp server how is everybody doing today i am doing pretty well and in today's episode guys we should be talking about a few things as i come in here and just check on how the basement is looking i've not checked on the basement in a few days so i was not sure hang on let me just adjust my microphone, my microphone quickly there we go uh, i was not sure what I had left it in in the last time I was here, and I wanted to just quickly check up on that. But now that I know it's in that state of affairs, I think I have a pretty good idea of what uh, what one of the things are that we're going to be doing in today's episode. Quickly, let me just check. Do I have anything cooking in here? No, I don't. And let's just quickly unload all the stuff that we don't need right now. I'll put the, uh, the uh, shovel back in. And we can just unload all of our stuff as we go out and start getting to work on a few little... Because you could call them chores in today's video. We have no room for this stuff, so we're just going to keep it in our inventory for the time being. And we should be good to go out. So, guys, in today's episode, we're going to be doing a few things as I just talk with you guys. We're going to be getting a few things done. Hopefully, getting this farm going. Because I want to fill this up more. And I also want to potentially expand this farm in the future. But let's just head out into the woods right now. And we're going to be cutting down a few trees. Because... One of the things that we have to do is we have to finish working on that basement. Now, I don't want to cut down these trees because it's way too close to the house, and I want to keep some of them up for just to make everything look good. So we're going to go out into that section of the spruce biome, and we're going to be cutting down a bunch of trees, hopefully to get maybe, I'd like to say like two stacks, two and a half stacks of, of uh, spruce wood logs, and then we can make those into planks and finish up the roof in the basement, which would be very good because that's a project that I want to finish. So I think... This is far enough away from the house to begin cutting down trees. Now, my voice is not 100% today. I do apologize if you can tell, but I've got like two glasses of water next to me because I know I'm going to run out with one. Also, this is silk touch, so that's why the spruce leaves are getting collected, which is good. We can we always need spruce leaves, and we'll probably use those in like a building thing eventually, but we can use them to tower up, which is probably my favorite feature of having silk touch, especially when we got to do this. We have to go up to get the log so it doesn't leave so we don't keep so we don't leave it up there now we don't want to break these either we just we're just gonna break them like that that way they still decay and we don't have to worry about it so house is back over there so anything past this tree line here i think is going to be fair game to tear down we'll, we'll take this one on next but what i want to talk about today guys is that we started a new series yesterday and if you guys have not checked out that series, I definitely recommend you guys go and look at it. It is Micro Battles on the Mindplex server. Micro Battles is a mini game where four, hello chicken, uh, where four teams duke it out to be the last team standing in different mini arenas that you have to PvP in. It's a really fun game mode and a lot of bigger YouTubers do videos on it like um, uh, Preston does some videos on it. Uh, creep parts does some videos on it stuff so people like that do a bunch of content for it and i wanted to get into it and start making some videos for it i also just want to branch out my content a lot more do more videos on the mindplex server that's one if you hear that that's just my microphone stand being adjusted but that is one of the things that i want to work on in the future on my channel is bringing more mindplex stuff to to my videos because mindplex is the biggest minecraft server no doubt at least in english and american not american in english like in English speaking countries, Mindplex is the biggest Minecraft server. And I want to do content on it because obviously, why wouldn't I want to do videos from the biggest server? I mean, it's like, it's kind of self explanatory. And we did not mean to collect you, so we'll just break you and put you back. But yeah, that, those are my thoughts on that. If you guys have not seen the Micro Battles series yet, I do recommend going and checking it out because there's a funny thing that happens in the beginning of the first episode that I'm not going to. Not going to give away too much of right now, but if you guys want to know what it is, you're going to have to go back into that video and check it out for yourselves, because let's just say it has to do with a little little hacker, and that's all I will say. But besides that, nothing much has happened today. Um, today is Sunday as I'm recording this video for you guys, and the Micro Battles um, Part 2, the second game in that episode, was also recorded today, so I know what I'm talking about. That was when the hacker thing was recorded, but... I haven't really gotten up to that much today. Dan should be making me the Micro Battles thumbnail today, hopefully. So we'll have to see how that... You guys already know how that turned out. But hopefully it hopefully it turns out good. I've got high hopes for it. And we have a stack of spruce wood now, and we have 27 more. That's good. We're just going to keep getting a bunch more, and then we can go back down into the basement and start working on that roof. So let's just pillar up again and get rid of that. 
And let me just eat this bread quickly. I went back to the village by spawn to get this bread because I have a pretty bad food situation on the server right now. I really, I have no sustainable food source. My farm, honestly, it doesn't grow fast enough for me to call it a sustainable food source. And the animals around here are very diminished because I used them in the past for food. So we're kind of coming to a bit of an animal and food crisis on the server that is. I'm going to have to take a day, like when I get home from school or something, and just go out. Like, go explore really far out in this world and try to find a ton of animals and get a ton of food. Maybe a couple stacks even. I think that would be the best thing for me right now because I need, I need a sustainable supply of food that's something that i'm really in need of right now and hopefully i'll be able to do that because it's kind of annoying having to rely on the bread from the villager farm constantly especially when that bread only grows when someone is in the vicinity of the villager farm and speaking of spawn actually in the villager the villager uh, farm slash village i guess you could call it <laughs> it's, just, it's just a village uh fluffy has made a new shop at spawn which we're going to go check out after we get rid of all these trees he has built himself, we have a stack now, so I think we're good with spruce trees, but he's built a mail slash post office. This is the wrong way. He's built himself a mail slash post office where you can set up a post office box, and that is the spot where you can have items and all this kind of stuff delivered to you, and I think it's a really cool idea, so we're going to go back to our base, grab some lapis blocks, and what we will do is we will probably go and buy ourselves a mailbox spot in that shop. Um, off camera, I've made a little bit more progress on the shop, and I've also begun going out and getting the items that we're going to be selling. Now, I have purposely not told you guys the items we're going to be selling yet, because it is a surprise. You guys will know when the episode goes out where I complete the shop, but it's going to be cool. I'm excited for what we're going to be selling at the shop, because I think it's something that is fairly original. Not a lot of people do it. I mean... I don't know. I'm sure everybody, I'm sure there's been shops for everything at this point in, on servers, but it's an idea that not a lot of people take. So we're going to, we did not mean to place that. We're going to go and grab ourselves some lapis. I believe, uh, let's make ourselves, let's make these into blocks. Very good. And before we do that, we'll, we'll use this for, uh, let's just see how much roofing are we going to need. Let's go down and just quickly check how much are we going to need for this? Okay, let's look. Looks like we're not going to need too much, so we might even be able to just quickly, quickly bang this out now. That way we don't have to do it later, so let's just do that. I will, I'll fix those misplaced blocks in a second, but I just want to get this roof, I just want to get this roof done, like so. Let's just go along here. Also guys, I went into the city the other day, and I went to check out the YouTube creator space, and it was really cool. They were shooting a, uh, a thing for Fashion Week, New York Fashion Week there. I believe Vogue was there and a bunch of beauty slash fashion YouTubers. So I wasn't able to go too far into the studio, but the place looked really nice. So it was pretty cool to see. Okay, so we got the ceiling done, which is good. And now what I think we're gonna do is I'm gonna make a cut real quick and I'm gonna go over to Spawn and we're gonna go check out Fluffy's new shop. Alrighty guys, so we are back at Spawn and if we head over here, we can come and check out Fluffy's new little shop as we can see here. Ladies and gentlemen, it doesn't have a sign yet, but we're going to go in and check it out anyway. This is Fluffy's mailbox business. So as you can see in the center here, he has a nice little water fountain. He's got a crafting table in case you didn't make your lapis lazuli into blocks. I'm not 100% sure if you have to pay with lapis or if you have to pay, if you have to play with lapis lazuli or lapis lazuli blocks. So we could, I mean, it says here that you need to pay with five lapis. So... I'm assuming, I'm assuming he means lapis block, I mean lapis lazuli, he would say lapis blocks if he wanted to pay with that, so I guess we can go ahead and pay him five lapis, and what we can do is, uh, do, 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 I guess we can go and put our name on one of the mailboxes, I guess we'll do the run right next to Fluffy, call it, what did they do, he did the plus minus, he did the, he did this, right? That, 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 no, 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 that, 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 there we are. And then it was Linky's, uh, mail box. There we are. And then that, 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 that. Perfect. All right. So we have a mailbox now. It's pretty nice. So we now have this nice little mailbox at spawn. Let's go see if anything else has changed around spawn since I was last here. doesn't really look like it. 
Um, we could go check to see if the player stats are fixed, I guess. Because some guy got on the server a few weeks ago and griefed. And that wasn't fun, but... Let's see, I have the player stats fixed. The si These signs are back up, but it doesn't look like the player stats are back on yet, which is okay. I mean, DJ can get to that whenever he pleases to. I would do it, but I have no idea what the player stats were before. I mean, now thinking about it now, I could possibly go back and watch one of my older episodes of Purge, where I think I showed off the player stats box, and we could fix it. Maybe, actually, I might do that off camera. So, yeah, I think I might do the player stats off camera. Hello, Mr. Chicken. And I could get that done for DJ to be a nice little guy. Nice little Purge SMP citizen. But anyway, guys, I think we're going to end off today's episode of the Purge SMP here. If you all enjoyed today's episode, let me know in the comments because a lot of you said you guys really like these kind of chilled out, just gathering materials, slowly making our way in the world episodes. I think they're really nice to do once in a while. Hello, Mr. Skeleton. Also, Purge will probably be switching to 1.9 when it comes out, so... We're going to have to get used to all those changes. I might make a few snapshot videos in the next few weeks here because they're adding a bunch of cool changes for 1.9. And these are actually pretty nice changes. I like them. They're changes I've wanted in Minecraft for a long time. Uh, combat, I'm still not the biggest fan of. But, you know, I'll deal. I'll deal. Don't blow up. Oh, he killed the other creeper. Nice. But I'm not a fan of the combat changes yet. But I'll just have to get We'll all have to get used to combat and all that stuff in future versions of Minecraft. And anyway, guys, if you guys enjoyed... A like is very much appreciated, and as always, I've been Linky, and we'll see y'all in the next video. Peace.